people living in a mobile home park ran out of water. Now they're running out of time to vacate. Good evening, I'm Jennifer Kilman. David has the night off. The owner of the Susie Acton Mobile Home Park recently sent out eviction notices and lost water service for not paying the bill. Yesterday, we reported on the nonprofit Convoy of Hope helping deliver water to families living in the park on East Division in Springfield. Tonight, Color 10's Linda Ong learned another community organization has stepped in to help. Linda? Jennifer, there are at least 16 families living in this neighborhood. Many of them are on fixed incomes. Community Partnership of the Ozarks came out today and spent much of the day going door to door to talk to each household. For 74-year-old Eugene Sohn, home has been at the Susie Acton Trailer Park in Springfield for the past 15 years. I thought that this would be my, my last home that I would ever, ever live in. That's why I, I bought this this trailer. But this eviction notice means Sohn has two months to vacate the property. But now I'm I'm going to have to move and I I don't know where I'm going to go now. Shannon Rouse is Sohn's daughter. It's causing a lot of stress for him, you know, and I hate for him to, you know, have another heart attack or something like that or, you know, something like that because you can tell it's, it's the stress is weighing on him. It's stress shared by the entire neighborhood. You know, we realize that this is kind of a tough situation. That's why Community Partnership of the Ozarks came out to talk to residents. We're just trying to collect information to shine it figure out where people are at and maybe what needs that they are there are and so I mean we're gonna be following back up with people and just trying to work through the situations with them for now the options are to leave their trailers yeah, some of them don't have the they're not equipped to move and then some of them are they would fall apart in the transition or relocate altogether which can cost thousands of dollars money Sohn says he just doesn't have I can't afford both the rent and a deposit at the same time Sohn hopes the property owner will consider giving residents more time. I try and try my darndest, but I don't know if I can be out of here in 60 days. That's too short of an amount of time to expect these, these people that have lived here for their whole lives, you know, to up and move. Community Partnership of the Ozark said they have set aside a small pot of money to help out these residents, but they'll need the help of other organizations to help out this neighborhood. We reached out to the owner of this property, of this trailer park, and she did not return our call. We're reporting live in Springfield, Linda Ong, Color 10 News. All right, Linda, thank you. Police